Well, thanks for joining us. This is TVC News at 7. The spike in banditry and other violent crimes is putting the police on edge and forcing it to improve its strategies on combating crime. One of such strategies is Operation Puff Adder 2, which aims to cut off supply of arms to bandits. And this is yielding results with the latest recovery of 1,565 rounds of ammunition from 50 suspects. Defense correspondent Sifon Isien reports. A harvest of crime suspects. Among them are four members of a gang being held for gun running. The person is giving me this ammunition is BG. This is an attempt by the police in an operation codenamed Puff Adder 2 to cut off supplies of arms and ammunition to bandits operating mostly in the northern part of the country. How many times have you delivered this ammunition before? Two times, sir. What's the total number of ammunition you conveyed? 700. What kind of vehicle did, were you using or did you use? By here. Golf. Items recovered from them include 1,565 rounds of ammunition. This is part of a larger number of items recovered from the 50 suspects. We have recovered from these suspects one AK-47 rifle, seven locally made pistols, a total of 2,496 rounds of live AK-47 ammunition, cutlasses of different shapes and sizes, house breaking implements, five cartons of tramadol, four bags of weed suspected to be in their hem. The spike in banditry and other violent crimes is putting the police on edge. It's unclear what other strategies the police are implementing to curb kidnapping and banditry in the country, but one thing is certain, the security of the country is in dire straits. Sifon Esien, TVC News, Abuja.